huge my territory God enlarge my territory God no Lord bless me indeed I pray for increase bless me indeed yeah I pray for increase Bless me indeed. Shout out to the WTC gang. We the chosen ones, baby. Grand rising on this beautiful day. For we all know that this is the day that the Lord has made. And we shall rejoice and be glad in it. I got some good news for you. Shout out to the divine ones, to the star seeds all over the world. Guess what? God is about to enlarge your territory. Amen. I need everybody to put that in the comments below and say, Lord, enlarge my territory. Let me tell you something. You've been praying for increase. You've been praying for abundance. You've been praying for wealth. You've been praying for success. God is about to enlarge your territory. And I'm about to tell you why he about to bless you and give you blessings on top of blessings on top of blessings. But right now, I need everybody to comment 1111 below right now. Because let me break it down to you. You have been through the fire, the storm, and the rain. We already know that. But let me tell you the real reason why God is about to enlarge your territory is because you have been faithful and you have been true. My God, you have been faithful and true to God's word. So God told me to tell you he's about to enlarge your territory. Everything that you put your hands to do, he going to bless you. Everything you touch turns into gold. I need everybody to put that in the comments below. And say everything I touch is going to turn into gold You got to know that God, he got your back You have to know that God chose you for the mission You have to know that God is about to enlarge your territory Come on now, understand what I'm saying You have been given the short end of the stick for too long Come on now, you've been in that small territory for too long God is getting ready to open up the windows of heaven and about to pour you out a blessing, room enough to where you can't even receive it. My God. So God is about to enlarge your territory. No weapon that is formed against you shall prosper in the name of Jesus. Because let me tell you something, it just won't work. It's not going to work. God is about to give you increase. Understand what I'm saying? God is about to give you increase in every aspect of your life. So you owe God everything because the simple fact that when these people really wrote you off, when these people said that you wasn't going to make it in life, when these people thought that you wasn't going to really be successful, let me tell you what God did. God is enlarging your territory right in front of your enemy's face. God is about to enlarge your territory right in front of the people's face that said that you were never going to make it in life. My God, God is going to give you increase. I need everybody to put in that and to put in the comments below and say, Lord, give me increase in the name of Jesus. Lord, bless me coming in. Bless me coming out in the name of Jesus. Don't forget to pray for increase today because God is going to move on your behalf in the name of Jesus. Your wait right now is over. You've been waiting for God to enlarge your territory for so long. But I'm here to tell you right now, buckle those seatbelts. Get ready to enjoy the ride of your life because God is getting ready to enlarge your territory. Amen. That is some good news I want to tell you guys today. Continue to stay steadfast, unmovable always abiding in the work of God. Let me tell you something. Get ready to start assembly uh, with the saints. Get ready to go back into worshiping with the saints. Oh, how pleasant it is to worship with one another. Understand what I'm saying? Get, get back in the race is what I'm saying, guys. Get back into serving God and praising God with the saints. 
It says forsaken, not the assembly of the saints. God wants you to worship you know, with the saints in spirit and in truth. Get back in the race. Get back to worshiping with the saints. Because let me tell you something, when the saints go marching in, oh, when the saints go marching in, when the saints go marching in Oh, I just want to be in thy number When the saints go marching in Get back in the race Get back with, with worshiping with people who really love the Lord Because let me tell you what In order for God to enlarge your territory You got to worship with, the, with some people that's going through it just like you you have to you got to add fuel to that fire to keep on going to keep that fuel burning inside of you to keep you fresh and alert and to keep that anointing refreshed to keep your mind stayed on Jesus to keep that spirit to be renewed in the name of Jesus you got to go worship with the saints forsaken not the assembly of the saints my God, because God is about to enlarge your territory, but he needs you to be in the presence where you are using your gift. Listen to what I'm saying. God needs you to be in the presence of the saints where you can use your gifts and your talents for the Lord Jesus Christ. God needs you to be back in that race because these people out here, they're going through it without your presence, chosen ones. Guess what? There is no more fuel that's added to that fire. There is no more hope without your presence, chosen ones. These people need your anointing. These, these people need your gifts. These people need your presence right now. God told me to tell you, if you want me to enlarge your territory, I need you to use your gift that I have given you. I need you to draw all men unto me. I just want to say one thing, guys. I, I, I appreciate the compliments that you guys have given me. Some of you guys said I saved your life, but let me keep it real with you. God is the one that saved your life. I'm just his messenger. Amen. I'm just sent from God. I'm here to draw all men until the to, until God, until the most high. I'm here just to draw all men. I can't save nobody life. I can't put nobody into heaven and hell. I appreciate the compliment, but I take no credit from the Lord Jesus Christ. I give him all the credit. I give him all the praise, all the glory, and all the honor. Because if it had not been for the Lord who was on my side, who had blessed me with these gifts and these talents, I wouldn't be here today telling of his goodness. So I'm not saving lives. I'm just drawing men unto the Lord. Amen. I am not higher than God. My arms are too short to box with God. I got to keep it real with you. Understand what I'm saying? Because we are all, we're all human. We're all filthy rags on our best day. We have to stay prayed up. We have to stay unmovable. We got to stay steadfast. Always abided in the work of the Lord. So don't you even worry about it because God is about to enlarge your territory because you have been faithful and true. Understand, understand. Join my WTC mentoring program. My email is Jordan underscore Howard 18 at yahoo.com. Any prayer requests, any testimonies, if you need somebody to vent to, I'm your boy. Hit me up on the email. Understand what I'm saying? Be a blessing to my to my uh, cash app, to my YouTube channel. My cash app is dollar sign, God will provide 3-1. And my PayPal is God will provide 3-0. Whatever God put in your heart to give, be a blessing. Understand what I'm saying? Because let, let me tell you something. I'm coming out with more content, fire content. And don't you ever forget, if you need a friend, you already know you got a friend in me. If you need prayer, you already know you got a prayer warrior in me. If you need motivation, if you need inspiration, you already know you got the best motivational speaker in the whole wide world in your boy. We the chosen ones. Go get your blessing. Be blessed.